Yo, yo, what is good guys? I hope you're doing very, very well. Today we're going to look at phantom cryptocurrency. Why has it gone up today? Massive bounce on the daily time frame. We've seen an 11% pump to the upside. Guys, if you're new here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. I will be sticking around throughout the entire bear market. So we can see today, uh, you know, we bounced off a key key level of resistance and it was right here. So basically the 0.44, we've blasted back through now. Really, really nice to see. We had lots of resistance over here and we flipped it back into a support level. So nice to see. Since the bottom that we had over at this particular price level here, we're already up 100%. So you'd have doubled your money if you got in at this particular price level down here from the 12th of May. Crazy, crazy times in cryptocurrency. What I see happening at the moment is we're back above that 20 day moving average. And if we can hold this particular line, we're gonna see at least continuation to the upside to around the 0.61 price you know, level. So if we flip to our two hour time frame. Really what is happening at the moment is we are consolidating around this level now and we can see on the 15 minute exactly what is kind of happening. We've got a lot of support on this particular 0.482 price level. As you see, these two wicks here demonstrate a lot of buying pressure. Now this looked like a double bottom reversal pattern. We came all the way up to about 0.52 and we got a bit of a sell off since. So what I'm seeing now is actually almost like a falling wedge. So I do think it's possible that we could actually come down to these lower levels and lose the support at 0.48. But I believe that we will just end up putting through a, um, a higher low still. So I don't think it would be necessarily a bad thing. If we have a look over here, we could probably afford to come down to at least the 0.44 before seeing continuation to the upside once again. We had a massive bull flag right here. I mean, look at this impulse. If we measure the impulse so far, we come down to the 0.382 Fibonacci, and that's exactly where that level of support is, right here. So it's really, really key to identify this um, support zone right here. We've got the 0.48, we've got the 0.4839 as well, right here on the 0.382 Fibonacci. So I'm keeping an eye on these levels. I do think we can fall lower to maybe the 0.47 dollar, maybe at most the 0.46 dollar level. But right now I'm seeing a lot of stability for phantom and i think you know if we zoom out like i say it's realistic to look at a price target of at least 0.62 dollars so why did phantom do this well if we look down here there's an update on this article as of late may 2022 andre conjay's wallet was tracked to have 100 million phantom received tokens from binance andre was active on github in relation to a fusd version 2 comet the FTM price pumped to the upside on speculation that he returned to the project, hitting $0.46. The Phantom Foundation also clarified that the FUSD stablecoin is collateralized, backed by staked FTM. So this is extremely bullish news, guys, for Phantom. I mean, um, really, really exciting. It's put a lot of faith and trust back into the community. People aren't now excited again. What am I seeing for Bitcoin at the moment? Well, on the Bitcoin technical analysis, we're still trading in this huge symmetrical triangle. I think we need to at least break through the 30.5 level where we keep getting rejected on this resistance. I'd like to see us come back through the 30.9 level. And after that, we may be able to actually blast back through to about $33,000. Um, but of course, at the moment, things are still looking a little bit rocky because you could still look at this as a giant bear flag and if we were to lose this bear flag position um you know you're looking at coming down even lower to about eighteen thousand dollars i think that's extremely unlikely i think we're more likely to get a pump to the upside for now maybe retest some um, prior resistances you're looking at 31k 32.9, 34.5k. These are realistic price levels where the price could actually go to. So crypto fear and greed index today, we're sitting at 10 on the fear and greed. Means that we've got a lot of fear and emotions in the market at the moment. And extreme fear can be a sign that investors are too worried. That could also be known as a buying opportunity, guys. So make sure if you wanna grab some Phantom today or even Bitcoin, use the link down in the description below. Give it a click, open an exchange today and get your long-term hodling portfolio on the go. Crypto bubbles, well, also looking good. We can see BNB up 12.5% this week, Bitcoin up 2.3%, Ethereum up 2.9%, and we're holding these very sensitive price levels looking at 30.3K and $2,067 for Ethereum. If you're new here, make sure you do hop into my Discord channel. You can find it just down below. It's completely free, no strings attached, and please do subscribe, like, and comment to this channel. Thanks for watching. Stay crypto safe.